going in a bit of search of some climbs this afternoon. I'm in the Netherlands. There's not all that much climbing around here. But you see how much climb you have to climb. So I'm going to ride this climb 30 times now just to get the gain. See how it goes. Here we go. And there she is. I am still in the big chain ring though. Probably in the middle of my cassette, but you'll count it as a climb. You know, you've got to, you've got to do what you got to do, huh? But it kicks up there a little bit. Let's have a look. Oh, this weather is perfect. Oh. I know this video is a bit random today, but you know what? I thought I'd just make some little clips during the week. Make a cool video. If you guys enjoy it, let me know. If you don't, you know, your problem. Ha <laughs> ha! There we go. So, halfway up the climb now. Gotta watch out here. And, 270 watts. Big chain ring again. Bit of gravel here on this inside piece. And this piece it kicks up a bit more. It gets a bit steeper. We in the forest. Can't complain. Here's the top of the climb. Nice little view here. And that was the top of the climb. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do loops here. Whole bunch of loops of this climb. So that's one done, 29 to go. Okay, I changed my mind. I'm not going to do that climb 30 times because that's going to be boring. So I find another climb and uh, yeah, I'll ride this one. It's a longer climb, it's the highest point in the area, which is cool. And hopefully, it's not too crackly while I'm cycling the noise here, but yeah, the weather's great. I'm trying to find some climbing before uh, the next race. We've got one more race left of the season and in Italy and there's a mean climb on it, so I'm trying to find some climbs here in the Netherlands. So my plan here is to try and keep it, uh, keep my bike in the big chain ring and then just overgear some of the hills. So try and get some load on the legs and yeah, see if I can uh, emulate the hill a little bit here. Low cadence, high watts. U-turn training and my hill training done at the same time. Can't ask for much more.
vehicle number one again, the Tankenberg. Let's get some more gains. So that was a easy hour and a half ride. I tried to find every climb I could in the entire area. Um, and yeah, it was pretty good. Nice little ride, sun's out. Winter is coming here in the Netherlands pretty shortly. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this little how to find the mountains in the Netherlands. Look at that, 323 meters. That's a good job.